okay guys so it's going to be a quick tutorial so if you think if you want to make a pc game to convert to a android games you must need to the android inputs like you can control the vehicle all the player by touch so let me show you in this video so as you can see it is a now there's a create a simple landscape it's looking nice i just modify some and here's my vehicle okay let me show you first here's a vehicle it's looking very cool at this place and now i want that this vehicle can control in mobile so for that what you need to do is first of all make sure you have the icons so it kind of like indicated that which one is left or right or up down so then you'll create a widget because by widget you can cr uh, control that so we will call that uh, ui cn and then open the ui okay at the ui first of all what you need that first we need to add the icons here but we also need to make sure that it's in a button not an image so we grab our button and set the size by 100 by or 150 by 150 if it's small or big you can easily change up so just go to style then go to as you can see there's a lots of options so you need to search here that br so if you search only b so you found like this that all the brushes are come so first of all you need to set it to tile the white color okay so we can see our button so we need to all this just set to white color like that so once you've done you need to also set it to uh, that rounds to box okay set it all the box so it will be visible but we the round shape it's not visible okay so for do that okay so as you can see it's now set up so just click on compile okay now we need to just drag and drop our icon so here and here and here and here okay guys, so as you can see the icon is perfectly set up so just compile and save so as you can see this icon is good so you can easily control it to make it to the left or right hand okay so then make sure that once you set up like that you need to make sure that gravity okay guys don't forget to set up the gravity or it will be become fully damaged so we'll be do the same thing for the down section just now just duplicate for this time and give it an far and now at here we will again search that b so all the brush will become and then we will now set all the down icons so if you want you can set up a different type of image like uh, the highlights one or something so I'm, in my case i'm just giving like that so it's look nice and pretty enough good so also it's by default the gravity is right set because we duplicate from this one so okay now once it's done we need to click on uh the hover and unhovered so i will use the hovered and the unhovered okay the same like press and unpressed okay now what you need to do that this is our vehicle as you can see okay this is my vehicle so we also need to set up the vehicle class goodly okay at here so first of all what i do guys i'll be first this is in my this bp that advanced so we'll be just change our vehicle name to okay not delete sorry we need to just change our vehicle name for find it easily my my vehicle and now compile and save so now come in ui and now at the event gate even on construct we need to get all actor from class and from the actor we need to set up that my and as you can see the vehicle is comped and then we need to get a copy so you can use the reference and then we will promote a variable and we'll be give it name vehicle wrap that vehicle reference and just connect it with these plugs okay so one is done this is hover and hover word then just get this thing and now we'll be do the everything in our there so as you can see there's a by default give like that the throttle and this trying so now we need to create a custom event so custom event that go Oh sorry, not O. It's uh, go, go on, and then we'll be create another one. Custom event, go, and off. 
so one is for activating the go and second one is for deactivate the go okay so we'll be just simply um, now just duplicate here and just connect it with the go that once and if it's in a plus value so it's always grow to forwards so now we need to just set our vehicle components to connect it with this thing and then for stopping this thing will be use the zero value so just click plug here so it will be help us some like that zero okay so just click on compile and save now we'll be create another for the back so just let me when that back on so you can call this anything as you want and back off okay and for the back we'll be use the minus value that minus one like that and target with this thing and guys we don't need to create another one we need to just plug with the off one with zero value so it will be automatically worked okay so guys the custom events are now created now go to your ui and just from your vehicle you need to search that go and that is our go one for press and then go and off for the release so it will automatically become a stop if we hover that so if i click on saved also we need to do one more thing that we need to connect it our widget with our player or it will be not work okay so for con connecting with this so we'll be going our here that vehicle bp and at here will be create widget create widget and we need to set our class that ui and then simply just from the readable you need to add to viewport so it will be work 100 percent now let's compile and save and also we need to make sure that our mouse is enabled so we can control this thing so search here that mouse and click on used mouse for touch and now compile now it's just compiling now let's play so as you can see now if i just sometime in unreal engine that sometime it become glitch from the hover and unhover because the buttons from the viewports it's not work 100 percent because for some error but it will be work guys okay so we can also for for test for now we can use the press and release ones for example okay before demonstrate you okay and if you are using the press so make sure that you remove the release that forward one or it will be not work let's try it now so unfortunately guys i'm not sure that why it's not working but it should be work uh, because my button is not pressing okay like let's get some value from here that are it's working or not so print string that if it's doing that four words or something okay let's say check so as you can see the button is working but the string is not working okay you can remove this input so i think that will be work because if you have already PC inputs um, unfortunately guys it's not working uh, I tried to export this in Android then I'll be give you the result are it's working or not okay at that time you can wait some time yep guys as you can see that now if I just doing that just hover and hover that as you can see it's working okay so guys it's working 100 percent. so i hope you understand so thank you so much for watching guys love you all and bye bye and see you in next video